Welcome to Tinkernut.com's video tutorials. In this tutorial, I will show you different Google search hacks. This project is free to do and the reason for this project mainly is to help increase productivity. But it also shows you how you can get more out of your Google searches. For instance, I will show you shortcuts for finding things such as weather, stock information, and things like that. This first hack series is going to cover everyday shortcuts. Shortcuts for finding things that you will probably use every day. For instance, this first one is for finding weather information. To do this, just type in weather, colon, and then the zip code of the area that you're wanting to find the weather information for, and then click search. And the search results will bring up the weather information for the next four days for the area that you specified. The next hack is for finding stock quotes. To do this, just type in stocks, colon, and then the ID for the stock that you want to find information on. For instance, this is the information for Google. This next hack is for searching the Google phone directory. To do this, just type in phone book, colon, and then the name of the person or business that you're wanting to find. And this will search the Google phone directory specifically. The next hack is for finding tracking information. Just type in the tracking number. For, and this works for either FedEx or UPS. If it's FedEx, just type in FedEx and then the tracking number. For UPS, just type in the tracking number. This next one is for finding definitions of words. Type in define, colon, and then the name of the word that you want in the definition for. For instance, this will bring up the definition for law. This next hack is for finding movie locations and times. To do this, all you have to do is type in movie, colon, the name of the movie. For instance, this one is for finding 300 and then the zip code for the area that you're wanting to search and then click search and this will bring up all the locations and start times for the movie in that area okay, this next hack series is going to cover how you can get calculations fast through Google for simple arithmetic all you have to do is type in the equation for instance 1 plus 2 and then click search or you know 2 times 3 or 5 divided by 3 different things like that this also uh, works for more advanced equations such as uh, finding the cosine of one half um, or any other different type of trigonometric value this also works for even more advanced things like uh, factorials you can type in 25 factorial for instance and it will bring up that value now Google also supports converting different things. For instance, if you want to find out what 25 degrees Celsius is in Fahrenheit, just type in 25 Celsius in Fahrenheit and click search and it will bring up that value. That also works for converting money like pounds to uh, dollars or numbers to binary and different things like that. Now Google also supports constants. For instance, uh, if you want to find out pi, just type in pi and search, and it will give you the value of pi. This also works for things like Planck's constant. Just type in the name of the constant, and it will uh, give you the value after you search for it. Now, this also works for finding out things uh, such as the mass of planets or stars. For instance, if you want to find out the mass of the sun, just type that in and click search, and Google will return the mass of the sun in kilograms. You can also use this information in equations, such as if you want to find out the mass of the sun plus the mass of the earth, just type that in, search for it, and it will bring back the mass of the sun plus the mass of the earth in kilograms. Okay, This next series is going to cover just general search hacks first hack that we're going to cover is uh, searching a specific site. To do this, all you have to do is type in site, colon, and then the name of the site, and then what you're trying to find within that site. For instance, this returns all instances of the Beatles 
within the site Amazon.com. This next one is called Safe Search because it searches sites and filters out any pornographic sites. For instance, if you want to search for breast cancer but don't want uh, the risk of finding any pornographic sites in your search results, just preface it by uh, typing in Safe Search and then colon and your results won't have any pornographic in them, or pornographic uh, websites in them. Okay, this next hack is for finding specific file types. Just type in what you're searching for, then type in file type, colon, and then the file's extension. For instance, this is for finding PowerPoint presentations. This also works for zip files, uh, ZIP, DOC for uh, uh, Microsoft Word files, and different things like that. Just type in that, quick search, and it'll bring up all the results with that file type. Okay, now I'm going to show you how to combine different hacks. This uses the NURL hack, um, which by either using plus or minus, you can uh, omit or make sure that a specific term is in the, the results URL. This also uses the entitle hack, which uh, makes sure that a specific word is in the title of the page that you search for. And then I'm also searching for the file type mp3 and then the regular search results uh, for instance Pearl Jam and the search results will return any Pearl Jam mp3s um, that don't have HTM or HTML in the URL and also have index of in the title of the page now you can mess around with this uh, for instance if you want to find uh, video formats you can type in in URL and then the different video formats AVI, MPG, or WMV and then you can also type the uh, specific site that you're searching for such as rapidshare.com now if you wanted to search for different music types um, all you have to do is type in in URL mp3 um, WMA or uh, AUG, you know, just the different audio types that you're wanting to search for, and then the specific site that you're wanting to search in. And then you can also go so far as to add um, the search criteria for the MP3s, for instance, the Beatles. Okay, that's it for uh, this tutorial. Check out Tingernut.com for more.